Yo, what's going on guys? It's Royalty0135 here, and today we're going to play Survivor as Nancy Wheeler. So, I'm going to look at my perks. So, my perks are Sprint Burst, I'm going to use Inner Strength, Adrenaline, and Quick and Quiet. For an add-ons, let's put on, let's just put on a med kit. Let's for add-ons, uh, bandage, and butterfly tape. Offerings, we're not going to put any offerings on, so we'll just wait till we get it in a match. Should be pretty quick though, because yeah, I'm playing solo, so it should be very, very quick. And let me know in the comment section if any of you guys play Dead by Daylight. And let me know what perks to use as Nancy next time, because I have all these perks. So just let me know in the comment section. Okay, we are connecting to a match. Okay, so we got some pretty good people. So if you guys don't know, the main goal of this video game is to Repair five gens and escape the killer that's trying to kill you, of course. Name the killer, so. Now we're just waiting 20 more seconds, or unless everyone readies up right now, we'll get into a game. These are my other survivors. Not these ones, like, these ones, I have a level 50 meg, if you guys want me to play on that one next, I'll play on that one, if you guys want me to. But yeah, let's get into this game. If you see the bar on the bottom, that means it's loading, if you guys didn't know that. Trust me guys, this is a very fun game. Very fun. Okay, so we should be getting the game in about like five seconds. Okay, we are in a game. Let's go. So, since I have a med kit and the add on, I'm gonna keep that. Now, the goal is to repair the gens. If you guys see that, 
like over there you see that like tall light post that's where it gen is and your heart rate if that starts increasing that means the killer is right there right? there's a killer there it is. so if you saw that breaking right there which you probably did that's a hex totem that means the killer has a special ability and if you break a totem which if i find one i'll show you guys it that means you break his ability basically Jesus Christ is killing it's see how my heart rate's going up that means the killer is right next to it. I had no idea where this killer is I'm just gonna repair the gen over here. Okay, so no one's done this gen. I'm going right here. I think it's a ghost face, if you guys know what that is. It's a person with a ghost face. And if you see those, I, if I get the very flashy white bar, that means. That means it's a great skill pack. Oh, let me heal this guy. See, I got a great skill check right there. That means it increases it a little bit. And I failed right there, and that's, that's bad. That means it like cuts it back a lot more. But let's do this kind of If you have multiple teammates on this, or survivors, if you guys want to pause that, uh, the gen goes way faster. that yeah that, that i just got hooked guy or girl got hooked over there so if we try to go save them uh we'll get blood points and if you see to my left after i finish this gen you'll see like blood points like stuff that will say plus and those are my blood points to spend on my survivor or killer if i wanted to see in the left Above the gens, you see the plus symbol. So that means I got plus, and the max you can get for one thing is 8,000. So let me repair this gen right here. This is pretty boring because there's been no action so far, but I'm trying to win the game. Killer's right there. Hopefully the killer doesn't come to us or hook the person close to us. That would be bad. But I have sprinklers, so in case the killer tries to swing at us, I have to sprint 150 time, uh, percentage my normal speed. So. You could get away for like three seconds. But it's not super useful, but it's pretty good to scar off one hit. Okay, so I'm about to finish this gem right here. And we're gonna be on our way to the next one. Oh my. Okay, so he hit me right there, so I get a sprint burst. Well, technically an injury I've heard, to get away from the killer for a little. And the killer has to wipe off the blood. Oh god. I'm probably dead here. Oh, I missed. Okay, 
so that was a tank in that way. Okay, this killer is like terrible. Okay, he finally got me. He's, that was a pretty good chase. I'm not gonna win all the time because this killer can fall. Hop over windows, so it's super hard to get away. Okay, so I'm hooked now. So if I attempt to escape, if you see on the bar on the very bottom left, that's how much time I have left to get unhooked. And those blowing things are my teammates and yellow. So hopefully one of them tries to save me. This this guy just camps me the whole game, which happens a lot because he like a day like that. My teammates are This happens a lot. You get bad teammates that don't rescue at all. So you never know. Yeah, and this guy's just being gay, just hitting me, even though I'm hooked, so he does basically nothing. Mm. Alright. Nope. Okay, so now I have to struggle so I don't die, and if I let go of X, I will be killed. Yes. Okay, so I have adrenaline, and that makes me heal one health state instantly. And this guy's probably just gonna camp me the whole game, but it's... Man, this sucks. My teammate runs to me quick, and this guy doesn't face camp me in the whole game. Okay, I got one teammate running to me. Let's go, teammate. Let's run. Okay, so adrenaline right there makes me heal one whole state instantly. So that's very good. Oh, the hatch is right here. Okay, so... They open the gate over here, I think. Yeah, I think it's open right here, so we can escape, probably, because... And that, up there, is a timer. Just so you guys know. Oh, okay, good. Okay, let's escape there. Okay, so no one escapes F, knocks you instantly after one gate has been opened. So that guy got killed. So he's probably dead on hook. Let's see. And, okay, so. So yeah. So thanks, you guys, for watching, and be back soon.